compute the dot product of the vector valued functions u of t and v of t. We determine the dot product of a vector valued function just like we determine the dot product of two vectors. We determine the sum of the products of the x, y, and z components, which indicates u of t dot v of t is equal to two t sine t times five sine t. plus five cosine t times two t cosine t. And then we have plus the quantity t plus three times the quantity t squared minus four. And now let's determine the products. Two t sine t times five sine t is 10 t sine squared t plus Five cosine t times two t cosine t is 10 t cosine squared t. Multiplying the two binomials, we first have t times t squared, which is t cubed, plus t times negative four, which simplifies to minus four t, plus three times t squared, which is plus three t squared, and finally plus three times negative four, which simplifies to minus 12. Now if we focus on just the first two terms, Notice there's a common factor of 10t. If we factor out the 10t, we're left with 10t times the quantity sine squared t plus cosine squared t. And we should recognize the identity sine squared t plus cosine squared t is equal to one. So this simplifies to one. And we still have plus t cubed minus four t plus three t squared minus 12. Simplifying, because sine squared t plus cosine squared t is equal to one, we now have 10t plus t cubed minus 4t plus 3t squared minus 12. Last step is to combine like terms. Let's also write the terms in descending order. We only have two like terms. We have two t terms. Simplifying, we have t cubed plus 3t squared and then 10t minus 4t simplifies to plus 6t, and then we have minus 12. This is the dot product of the two vector valued functions, u of t and v of t. I hope you found this helpful.